On a recent Saturday morning in a quiet neighborhood in Rockville, the Blaisdell family got up before dawn. David Blaisdell was preparing for his son Christopher's weekly hockey practice. Christopher is 14 years old and plays on a team called the Montgomery Cheetahs. In the locker room at Cabin John Ice Rink, Christopher and his teammates put on their gear and step onto the ice. The Cheetahs look no different than young hockey players across the U.S., but in fact, their path to the game has been very different. My name is Amir Khan. I play for the Montgomery Cheetahs. My name is Maurice, and uh, I play for the Montgomery Cheetahs. Go, Cheetahs! <laughs> All the players on the team have varying degrees of developmental challenges, including autism. It was founded in 2006 with only 10 players and two coaches, but now has more than 80 players and a larger coaching staff. Head coach David Lucia helped start the team. Montgomery Cheetah's special hockey team is a therapeutic program for kids to help them socially, emotionally, behaviorally, in and out of the classroom, on and off the ice. It's life skills that can be taken from the ice and transferred into daily life. David Blaisdell, who speaks Mandarin from his overseas experience in China years ago, says much of Christopher's success on the ice can be attributed to the coaches. All the coaches and volunteers are very patient with Christopher. The coaches are volunteers. Some, including Coach Lucia, are major donors to the team. Wei Wei Zhang is Christopher's mother. Sometimes you get the sense that the coaches treat your child better than you do. In the locker room, the talk is all about hockey. Trying to pass, skate faster, shoot, score, high and low nets. I try to, when, I, when the puck comes to me, I put in the goalie. Little, I have to hurt. I think maybe when I skate backwards or maybe trying to block a shot. To be honest, it's a little scary to block a shot because I'm worried I might get hit. Wei Min Zhu is the father of Jiaozi. Children with autism don't mingle very well with other kids. First of all, they're not easily accepted by other kids. Secondly, they may receive special treatment. Neither is good for them to develop social skills. But on the Cheetahs, they feel they're all the same. They feel this is their own team. Chris Nagel is the mother of Donovan. His so the social aspect of it has been a huge help for him because he really enjoys being with his teammates. Whereas before he started hockey, he did not have that same endurance. He would tire out easily. He would like to sit and read books. The social aspect also helps the parents. Parents often find themselves under immense pressure because their children have special needs. The weekly team practice gives them an opportunity to relax and mingle. Marie Jacob is the mother of Henry, a Cheetahs player. With a special needs child that you have an a, a opportunity to be with parents that have a similar situation. Many parents serve on the team as volunteers and mentors. Christopher's father, David, is one of them. The more progress he makes, the more confident we parents grow, and the more grateful we are to the team. I want to do my share to be able to give back to the team. The American Special Needs Hockey Association says there are 50 teams like the Cheetahs nationwide, and the number of participants exceeds 1,500. Speed, endurance, teamwork, competition. Hockey is a fascinating but challenging game. We see how hard they try. They have so few opportunities out there that when they do get an opportunity and they shine, it, it just brings tears to everyone's eyes. For Yuan Yi, I'm Colin Lovett, VOA News. The Montgomery Cheetahs. Cheetahs.